Well, we're midway through run number one, and it's Jesper Schotter leading the way, but here's Alex Hall. Alex Hall going oh. huge there. So a lot of fun already getting thrown down. Alex Hall and Colby Stevenson, the two Americans, I saw them warming up. They were spinning like tops out there, a lot of hand drags, a lot of uh, nose butters and things like that. Big nine, is that what that is? Yeah. And so look at the real estate travel, Tom. The early pop really brings out the real estate. I mean, that was a solid 40, 50 feet off that knuckle and down. Alex Hall in seventh place. So we saw that hand drag 900, the first run. Oh, going for the butter there and then looking for the tap. We'll have to see in the replay if he got the tap on that knuckle. He's going nose butter. And then right here at three, he tries to tap. I think he's getting it. Taps the skis and then keeps going. Huge down the landing. Alex, a gold medal in slope style, a gold medal in big air. How about going for that trifecta, a gold medal in knuckle hug? Just, it's good vibes. I was at the start gate, obviously, while I was competing in this in Aspen, and just everybody wasn't tense. There wasn't that anxiety right. of competition you get with slope or big air. Everybody was talking and laughing and having a good time, and wow. wow. Then you get stuff like that where I don't know how they're not anxious and a little stressed when they're about to try this. Alex Hall has just been clinical. Just assassinating that thing, going huge, switch 10, getting the tail tap, grabbing the ski. Very, very cool one there from Alex Hall. I mean, just a ton of variety. What's that do, though, from a judge's standpoint of seeing somebody do a trick that somebody else has already done? You know, in slopes on big air, you expect it because a lot of the guys are doing the same tricks, the 1620s and those big spins. But in knuckle huck, they want to see variety. They want to see you doing something new, not just copying or doing the same thing that you saw somebody else do. Here's Alex Hall going behemoth, maybe the biggest of the night. I don't know how he continues to go bigger, but how in the world did he land that? That Absolutely was so far down. Absolutely yard. That could not have felt good on the shoulder. So here's Alex Hall sitting in fourth place. Has really looked so good here tonight. It's crazy that he's actually in fourth right now, Tom. Yeah, he's had a lot of tricks. Oh, there we go. Oh! What? Just when you thought it couldn't get any crazier, Alex Hall goes switch and then butters all the way off the tails and then count them. Switch 1440 in total. Switch hits the tails and then goes into a double cork, sort of 12 all the way around. That's what he wanted last time, had to open up. Is that the most difficult trick we've seen here tonight? Most difficult trick of the night. All the and way up to the top! Alex Hall takes over first place on his final attempt. And it's official. Alex Hall is your X Games Norway Ski Knuckle Hunt gold medalist. Huge run there. I mean, that final jump is what he needed to take that top spot. Alex, congratulations on your third gold. Now, Knucklehuck is quickly becoming a fan favorite. Is it one of your favorites to compete in now? Like, 100% my favorite to compete in. We're all just up there having a good time, like we always are, but in this one especially, I think, and they groomed the landing, it was snowing, so it was super soft, and we were just able to go like as big as we wanted to, so. And what about that last and final hit? Was that a good time standing up there, not in first place, knowing you had to throw it all in the line? Yeah, I was super nervous, but everyone was getting me so hyped to just send it. And yeah, I'm so hyped on that last trick. It was so fun. We're so hyped for you. Congratulations, Alex, and we'll see you tomorrow in Thank slow you. style. Yep. All right. What an impressive start to the X Games career of the 21-year-old Alex Hall. A gold in slope style, a gold in big air, and now a gold in knuckle hug, Tom. So much talent, so good at every aspect of skiing, 